Welcome back guys to another redstone tutorial. Today I will be showing you a semi hipster door. And what I mean by semi hipster is that there is no redstone at the top or in the wall. It's all underneath. So as you can see it's perfectly hidden when I close it. It's yeah, it's hidden and then when I flick it again, it will open all below us so it's all underneath so um i've marked out the stone is the removable blocks and then the iron is the blocks that have to be there so let me just quickly remove all of it it's actually not much only the wall and um yeah what i mean by semi yeah what i mean by semi is that is that um so you can't put glass like you would see this piston and this redstone torch if you put glass which um what i mean by semi is that you can see it if you use glass but um yeah if you if you use a non-transparent block you wouldn't be seeing it and um yeah that that's what makes it semi and um yeah it's tiny actually this is actually really tiny um so this section, this half, is the double piston extender, and then here is the, just the block thingy. So here is the input block, and you will see what happens. And there you go. So then here's another one. Essentially what this is, is that this piston quickly extends that block here, so it will appear like that. And then this piston will push the block here, so then there's two blocks, and then the piston will be pushed up. So like that. And then for the retraction, it's basically pulling it back down, and then a double piston extender retracting it back. And um, yeah, it's pretty simple. And um, yeah, let's go on with the tutorial. So what you want to start with is a two pistons in the middle with a block. And that is going to be your entrance. So let's go ahead and mark the entrance out. Which should be two by one gap like this. So then you want to get a block, like diagonal block. And then put a torch here, behind here. Put a block, put a torch, put a block, put a torch. And then a piston below it. And then also a piston next to it. So like that. And so you want to put a torch here as well. And that should extend. Put another block there. And that should be your input block. And then you want to get um, a dropper, a comparator, and a hopper. And you would need two of each of these. Because there's two monostable circuits that use this technique. So then you just do this. So like that. I think... I think you do that, yeah you do that, and then drop an item in, and I'll just pick that up again, um, put in a block, and then a torch, and then a block, and then a torch again, it should flash, and then, um, what is it, a repeater, a repeater, and then a repeater into a block, and this one should be like that, I think, yeah, um, no, it shouldn't. Okay, opposite way. So there's a redstone dust and there's your torch. And so you want to put a block here, put in your second dropper with your second hopper and your comparator into a redstone repeater. And um, yeah, I think there you have it. So then you want to drop another item in, I just remembered. And so then you want to test it out. And... Um, Oh, right, right, yeah, you need a block on top of here, and then that would be your double piston extender done. As you can see, um, it's perfectly working fine now, and um, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the tutorial. Um, it did go over time because I had to figure out that problem, but anyways, thank you guys for watching. Give it a thumbs up, don't hesitate to subscribe if you're new to the channel, and um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial.